Hey everyone, I'm Hector Mirai, and this is Faith and Fandom 180 on LTN Radio. So I'm playing Pokemon Scarlet, and my daughter is playing Pokemon Violet. And sometimes we just hang out in the room together while we're playing, and I'll occasionally help her if she needs it, but mostly we just enjoy hanging around. And so I'm having a ball. The game's really fun. Once you get past the tutorial of the little Pokemon Hogwarts scene, uh, they basically give you the whole rest of the game to explore on your own. Like, they'll say, hey, there's a bunch of titans over there, there's some gems over there, there's some bad guys over there, have at it. Whereas with many games, you basically only have one path to choose from, this gives you a whole world and says, go for it. And my <laughs> daughter, who is nine, got really frustrated at that. She's like, wait, I'm, I just pick where I'm going? I need, I need this to tell me where to go. I, I need someone to guide me. I was like, well, where do you want to go? Go, give that a shot. And if it doesn't work out, <laughs> try something else. And it just really frustrated her. So she's like, okay, tell me where you went. And there's just this point where sometimes we really want someone to guide us. And it reminds me of this verse in Proverbs 16, 9. It says, in their hearts, humans plan their course but the Lord establishes their steps. And so often, especially in working in the ministry bubble, uh, I've heard people really just want God to give them a direct path of where to go. But God also wants you to put your input in there. You know, as he says, in their hearts, humans plan their course, but the Lord establishes their steps. You actually have to have a desire. You actually have to have some kind of focus you actually have to have something you're seeking to allow the lord to guide you because if you're just waiting for god to put a desire on you you're gonna be waiting a while I, just like i told my kid figure out where you want to go and the game will help as believers if we actually have a desire we have a direction and we bring it to god then he's fully going to actually show us how to get where we're going but we have to actually take the step ourselves remember to catch faith and fandom 180 every wednesday morning on the back row morning show only on ltn radio and if you'd like to learn more about faith and fandom head over to faithandfandom.org where you can learn about our comic-con ministry podcasts memes apparel and book series you can even read new chapters before they make it to the next book i'm hector mirai and thank you for spending the last 180 seconds with me